Hey dear students, my name is Zarina Bidulaevna. Welcome to our English lesson. Before we start our lesson, let's watch the video, please. And try to guess what are the theme of our lesson. Yes, you are quite right. Today we will talk about British meals. And aims today our lesson is to introduce with a new words and talk about British meals. Let's start the task. Uh, learn new words. Repeat after me. Look at the screen. It is a new words. And repeat after me. Breakfast. Завтрак. Dinner. Обед. Саппе – ужин, сириал – крупа, эк – яйцо, бейкон – бекон, томато – помидор, тост – тост, a cup of tea – чашка чая, roast beef – жареная говядина, meat – мясо, chicken – курица, juice – сок, coffee – кофе, vegetable – овощ, Desert – десерт. Mutton – баранина. Thank you, students. The next task is we are going to work with the text. Look at the screen and watch the video, please. Try to understand the text. British food sometimes has a bad reputation abroad. But food in the UK is far from being bland. London is a great place for fine dining and many celebrity chefs such as Jamie Oliver and Gordon Ramsay are British. While in any city in the UK you can find international restaurants with great food from all over the world, traditional British food is still popular at home and abroad. But what is traditional British food? Let's start with breakfast. A full English breakfast might not be the healthiest way to start the day, but it certainly is the tastiest. A full English usually includes sausages, bacon, fried tomatoes, baked beans, eggs and buttered toast. For lunch, there is nothing more convenient than a sandwich. My favourite is a BLT made with bacon, lettuce and tomato. Of course, sandwiches are popular throughout the world, but this simple meal was invented by the Earl of, yes, you guessed it, the Earl of Sandwich. Sandwich is a town in the southeast of England. For an afternoon snack, there's West Country cream tea. Scones with butter, jam and cream with a cup of tea. The English love to drink tea, but always with a little milk. For dinner, I'll introduce the top five traditional British meals. Number one, roast beef. So popular that the French call the English roast beef. It is served with roasted vegetables, potatoes and Yorkshire pudding and covered in gravy. Number two, fish and chips. The fish is usually cod or haddock, which is deep fried in batter, served with chips and mushy peas. Number three, pie and chips. Popular pies are steak and kidney or steak and ale, served with chips. Number four, shepherd's pie. My favourite. Made from minced lamb covered with mashed potato with cheese on top. Served with steamed vegetables. A similar dish is cottage pie, which is made with beef instead of lamb. Number five. Toad in the hole. Sausages baked in Yorkshire pudding batter. Served with gravy and roast vegetables. Mmm, delicious. That's the end of this quick introduction to British food. Tell me about the food from your country in the comments section. Thank you, dear students. 
If you understand the text, let's do the next task. The next task is true or false. Look at the screen. True or false? The first sentence. Many British people have a big breakfast. True or false? The second. People often have a cereal or toast for breakfast. True or false? The third. Marmalade is made from any fruit. True or false? People drink tea with hot milk. True or false? The fifth. Many foreign visitors love English coffee. True or false? Six. All British people have a hot lunch. True or false? The seventh. Pubs are good places to go for lunch. True or false? Eight. British people eat dinner late in the evening. True or false? The ninth. Sunday lunch is a special meal. True or false? Tenth. When you get takeaway meal, you eat it at home. True or false? Okay, dear students, let's check up the task. The, the first sentence. Many British people have a big breakfast. Is it, uh, it is it true? The second. People often have cereal or toast for breakfast. It is it true? Third, marmalade is made from oranges. It is a false. Fourth, people drink is tea which people have with a cold milk. It is a false. Fifth, many visitors to Britain find English coffee just horrible. It is a false. Sixth, lunch is a quick meal. It is a false. Seventh, pubs are good places to go for lunch. It is a true. At midday dinner, it is a false. Sunday lunch is a special meal. It is a true. When you get a takeaway meal, you, you eat it at home. It is a true. Okay, dear students, the next task is fill in the gaps. And these words help you to do the task. The, uh, the First sentence, English breakfast is a big. The second, people have with the milk or juice. The third, people have tea with milk. Pubs, good cheap food. Many children take a from home. The English, they a basket with all sorts of sandwich. Dinner in some homes is considered to be the meal. Tea is a favorite in England. At lunch, cold mutton, fish, pickles, generally the table. English mutton is a. Let's do the task. Okay, if you are ready, let's check up the, this task. The, the first sentence. English breakfast is a big meal. The second. People have cereal with the milk or juice. The third, people have a tea with a cold milk. The fourth, pubs serve good cheap food. The fifth, many children take a snack from home. The sixth, English load their baskets with all sorts of sandwich. The seventh, dinner in some homes is considered to be, to be the main meal. Eighth, Tea is a favorite beverage in England. Ninth, at lunch, cold mutton, fish, pickles, generally the great table. The tenth, English mutton is a treat. Okay, thank you, students.